To use group submissions in Moodle assignments, you first need to ensure that you've put your students into groups. You can do this very quickly by going to the Participants tab at the top of your page and then selecting Groups from the drop-down menu. You can manually set up groups or you can choose to auto-create groups. Choose how many groups you want and then click Submit. I now have all the students in my module added to two groups, Groups A and Group B. Back in the Moodle assignment, go to the settings and turn on Group Submissions. There are a few options that appear when you select the group submission. Turning this first one on will ensure that students cannot submit an assignment unless they have been added to a group. We'll look at the second option in a moment. With the group submissions enabled, when you go to View Submissions, you'll see the student groups listed. And rather handily, you can sort student submissions by group as well. Now, when a student from Group A submits into the assignment, that assignment will appear as a submission for the whole group. Other group members will be able to edit or remove that submission up until the due date, and whatever changes they make will similarly show for the whole group. When the instructor adds a grade or feedback for any group member, that grade or feedback will appear for the whole group. In order to make it clearer to students when a submission is still in a draft state and when it has been made a final submission, you can enable a Final Submission button in the Assignment Settings. Go to the Submission Settings and look for the option to Require Students to click the Submit button. When a student submits an assignment now, they're not asked to tick an authenticity statement and in their assignment window, they will see that the submission is in draft form and has not been submitted. At the top, they will now see three options. They can still remove and edit the submission as normal, but they can also choose to finally submit the work when they're ready. With this Submit button enabled, you now have the option to require all students in a group to click on Submit. Now this means that all group members, whether they themselves have added a file or not, are required to click on the Submit button. Students will be able to see which students have still to click on Submit, and only after all students have clicked on Submit will the assignment show as having been submitted.